Okay, y'all listen to me. This box, this box right here just came in the mail. Okay. <laughs> it came in the mail and I had to show y'all this box. Like, this is why y'all cool grays said preparing shipment for so long. It's because they had to make the boxes. Like, I'm not even sure if y'all can see like what's going on. Like, here's a part of the box. And then this is another part of the box. And like, I'm not sure if it's one box or we had that part or if it's two boxes. But look, y'all can see what's in the box. Man, I'm so glad I don't have one of those those UPS people <laughs> that be stealing y'all boxes because th there's no way you can't know what's in this box. Like, I, I'm scared to open it because I don't even know what my actual shoe box going to look like in here because I can tell y'all right now, there's no protection in this box. Nothing. It's just all raw. Just raw dog in it, okay? They just threw it in here. It's one little tape on here. Like, okay, so this is one box. I thought it was like two pieces of cardboard put together. I thought they asked us was making shoe boxes, making boxes and shit at uh, Nike. So, here's my shoe. This box is shit. I am so glad that this box is not beat all to hell because <laughs> I know how they be tossing that shit in there. Now, look, you got a little bit of damage on the corner, but I ain't going to complain um, at all because that box is beat to shit. So, y'all know what it is. This is the Air Jordan 11 Cool Grays. I hit on the shock drop, but this pair right here is my man size. Six, no Y right there. That's a men's size six. Y'all see the tag right there? What did I say? 225, 225. Yeah, that's what I paid for them. That's what I paid for them. So, um, I'm gonna open this up and pray to God it ain't something in here besides. Oh, them. It's stuck. What the hell? It's stuck to the inside. The plastic It's stuck on the inside of the box. Like, it wasn't all the way taped down. Like, they was throwing this shit together. It was not all the way. It's sticky, but it wasn't all the way down. So, um, I'm excited to open these. These are actually my first pair of 11s that are a men's 11. So, um, normally I have to buy, if it's not a women's release, I have to buy GS sizes. So, um, here they are. I've never had these. Like, I bought these for my son when he was one turning one he won for his first birthday in a video i mean in a well in a photo shoot his little photo uh thing his little photo hookup for when he turned one and he had the whole little suit on so <laughs> he was so cute but um yeah man i don't know if there's a big difference between the men's pair and the gs pair but other than the fact that okay hold the fuck up because from my understanding the men's pair supposed to come with plastic inserts. What the fuck is this? What is this? I specifically bought a men's pair so I could have the plastic inserts. This is not plastic. This is cardboard. What? I don't care. That say me. That say me and size six in there. Y'all see that? Can y'all see on the inside where that says me and six? I can't really see the camera, but. It says me and six in there. I am pissed. Like, what's the point in me having these if, like, I don't get it. I don't. Where's the extra $40? I, I was really excited because I felt like I mean, yeah, I was paying forty dollars for plastic inserts. I don't care, but where's my plastic insert? Do okay. Wait, let's see. No, this cardboard too. It ain't even this cardboard. Like, I want a plastic fucking insert. I'm so mad right now. Okay, like, I'm glad to have a shoe because I got a GS size somewhere around here. Okay, so, 
here is my GS pair. We about to open these up. Because now, like for real, what the fuck? So, here's the right shoe. Now, here's it's about right to turn shoe. into a comparison video. I mean, there is a difference in the patent leather. There is definitely a difference in the height of the patent leather. So, I don't know if y'all can see that. But there is definitely a difference in the height. Okay, that's the men's pair. This is the GS pair. So there is definitely a, a height and a difference of the pad leather. Okay. Um, the jump man is actually a little bit larger as well. So there's that. Uh, 23. So there are some differences, okay? Like the 23 is more in the middle on a men's pair as opposed to being all the way up top of the back of the ankle on the GS pair, which is on the bottom. It's just a higher cut patent leather. It is. The cut of the shoe is a little different. So, okay, there's that. But, like, man. Okay, but I actually like the carbon fiber print of the GS pair better than I do the men's pair. Like, it'll look like circles almost on the men's pair. Opposed to being, like, squares in, like, a stitched pattern like that. I like it better on there because these just look like little circles see and let's see eh, not a big difference on the bottom that I can see um, don't know if you see that there's not really a difference uh, this one may be the men's pair may be a little bit wider as well um, I see that but other than that I am still pissed about not having plastic inserts like I was really looking forward to that <laughs> like that was really my whole big deal with being able to grab a men's pair but like I said y'all can see there are differences between the men's and the GS I did cop one of each for myself for personal pair um and of course I did get my son Donovan a size six so we are now in the same size shoe no he is not getting to all this okay he is not getting to all this he can still buy his own shoes and he not wearing his mama shoes no 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 boo boo um because he is extremely hard on shoes and i have to buy him shoes all the time and honestly he's more into if i say if you wear jordans they're twelves so there's that so man here's the cool gray 11s and the men's size again there are some differences between the gs and the men's pair but <laughs> i'm so mad about my inserts nike come on man do me right please so i'm gonna contact them to find out for real if that's like a flaw like if i got a, a messed up situation or if in fact small sizes just came with, with cardboard um so that's that uh if y'all were able to get on these i know today is tuesday i'm shooting this video on tuesday so i know they did an exclusive access for these as well um if you were able to hit on that exclusive access let me know below if you got lucky on that today um which would actually be yesterday when y'all see this video but um let me know man if y'all were able to get lucky on the shock drop because as you can see I told you i got my pair um in gs i got my pair in men's and then i got baby boy a pair in gs as well so i hit three pairs on the shock drop um two more to go little nephew gotta make sure he tidy right and um my big guy my big guy over here my teenager my 17 year olds gotta get that big size 12 in the men's so <laughs> two more of the cool grades it's a family thing we keep it all, all gravy around here with the family when the 11s drop if y'all not subbed up to the channel sub up to the channel man like it share it go ahead get that notification bell also who has the heat man we're coming hard with seven, season seven uh with myself mcfly kof we got e-money shoes and of course pm kicks if you are not sub to who has the heat on youtube sub to the channel man hit your notification bell so you know when we come through then also subscribe to my brother's channels man mcfly 
E Money PM. They all got YouTube channels and they're all on Instagram as well. Those tags. So y'all go ahead, hit them up, sub up, follow. Good people, all, all variety of sneakers, man. E Money, Rich Gang, right there. So you know how we, you know how he do it. You know about Rich Gang. You know what it is. So y'all go ahead, hit us up. Until next time, I'm gonna go soak about my plastic inserts. Peace.